Now, new kid, this might get confusing, but listen close, okay? If you were born a boy, that's called being a cisgender boy, okay? Or cis for short. But, well, you, you might have transitioned into being a boy. You see what I mean? If you were not born a boy, but now a... Uh, I identify as one, well, that's called being transgendered, okay? Or trans for short. Okay. So, um, do you identify as being cisgendered or transgendered? <laughs> Take your time, okay? Okay, can you just hang on a minute? I need to call your parents. <laughs> just take a second. Uh, hello, this is Mr. Mackey, the school counselor. Yes, hi. Uh, I have your child here in my office, and, well, he's just let me know that he's cisgender. That means he identifies with the sex he was assigned at birth. Oh, you knew that? Okay. Well, no, no, it's it's fine. I just wanted to make sure that you knew he had other options. You know, you don't, you don't always have to go with the first hand you're dealt. Huh? Okay. Yeah, no, that's that's great. That's great to know. Uh, I think I can really maybe be of help from here on out. Uh, Thank you very much. Okay. Bye-bye now. Okay. Well, I'm really glad we had this talk. As a cisgendered male myself, I know how hard it can be out there for a boy who chooses to love someone of the opposite sex. Just remember, love is love. Even if you're a guy who happens to like titties. Okay. <laughs> Just be careful, okay? Because there's, there's a lot of people out there who don't accept you for what you are, and then you're going to have to deal with them, okay? So, uh, but come see me anytime.